Do you recognize that feeling that you just want to release the pressure of your back? The pressure and the pain you might be feeling because of a slipped disc, sciatica, some wear and tear? Well, that's exactly what I'm going to demonstrate and show you in this video. I'm going to demonstrate some really effective passive and active spinal decompression techniques you can do for the comfort of your own home to release that pressure and that pain of your lower back. As a matter of fact, we love spinal decompression so much that we've acquired a special table just to do this for our patients. So this video comes with a handy worksheet which is available for a small fee from our website and I'll link to that in the uh, comments down below. Okay, let's get started. So this is an absolutely brilliant spinal decompression stretch and it's a passive one. As in, you lay there, you don't have to do anything and gravity is doing the work for you. So what you need is a bench or your bed at home. Uh, you lay on it on your tummy. So I'm making sure that my tummy is almost like over the edge. And all I do now is my, drop my arms back, drop my head back and lay like this for about 30 seconds, maybe up to two minutes. Just feel that really lovely decompression on your lower back and make sure you breathe into this stretch. Really breathe in and out. And when you're breathing out, drop your head, drop your arms and feel that decompression on your spine. And again, hold this for about 30 seconds to about two minutes and you can repeat this all day long. Now, if this doesn't give you enough decompression you can use some pillows so you can use one or two depending how much traction you need so let me demonstrate this with two pillows so put two pillows on the edge of your uh, bench or your bed climb on top again put your tummy on top of it slide your top part of your body over the bench and again really stretch this out arms down drop your head Breathe in and out, breathe in deeply, out deeply. And when you're breathing out, really relax that lower back of yours and feel that stretch for about 30 seconds to about two minutes. And like I said, you can do this all day long. So that's your first decompression stretch I'm demonstrating to you. Now there's something else you can do. If this is not uh, intense enough for you, I'm going to demonstrate another one to you, which is probably maybe a little bit more intense to do. So some of my patients prefer to do this passive stretch the other way around. So let the, the legs hang off the bench instead of the upper body. So that's something else you can do. Um, it might be a little bit more intense. It might work better for you. And all you do now is lean over the bench. And again, hold on and drop your legs down like that. Again, a lovely spinal decompression here. Hold this again for 30 seconds to about two minutes and really breathe into the stretch. So when you're breathing out, relax your body. Everything hang. And same thing with this as we did with the other one. If this is not uh, intensive enough, just use a couple of pillows on the side, one or two, depending on what you need. Build up the height under your belly button. And the same thing here now. And, um, and really lovely, look at that. Great stretch here to, spun, decom to get some decompression in your lower back so these are some fantastic passive stretching techniques and you can lay like this all day long and it should give you really nice and relaxed feeling and take away the pressure and the pain of your lower back using these techniques so for my first two decompression techniques i need a couple of chairs and what we do now very simple you need some sturdy chairs some sturdy backs on it as well and all i'm going to now stand in between the chairs place my hand palm on top of the back of the chair and then very gradually transfer the weight from my legs to my arms, keep my elbows straight. So transfer the weight here, thereby decompressing the spine, yeah? releasing the pressure on nerves and the discs. Hold this for about, well, if you can, two minutes, but it might be a little bit too much. Maybe you can do a minute or maybe 30 seconds. And you, you can repeat this throughout the day. So if you could do a series of three or four, at once and then do it later on in the day, absolutely perfect. So you hold this position for about 30 seconds to about two minutes, whatever you can, what you can accomplish, and then take the pressure again on your legs. So that's the first technique. The second technique what you need to do is, is what you can do is place your hand palms 
away from you on the back of the chair. Keep your elbows nice and straight. Place your feet a little bit behind you. And all you do now, again, same thing, is hanging whilst arching your back. This is a particularly good exercise for a slip disc. So again, hold this for about two minutes. Repeat uh, three to five times if you can. Uh, and then repeat this throughout the day. So these are two really simple and very effective spinal lumbar spine decompression techniques. So this next technique is another example of a really good passive decompression technique. And all you need for this is a ball, a yoga ball, an exercise ball. Uh, so this ball is about 55 centimeters in circumference. I'm about 5'10", 5'11". So for me, it's absolutely perfect. Make sure it's nice and firm. You don't want it too soft. If you're taller, you might want to get a bigger ball, a 65 centimeter one or a 75 centimeter one even, uh, but this is good enough for me. So uh, what you do with this is you place this ball roughly where your umbilicus, umbilicus is, so your belly button, so you lean over it, sure it's nice and here, there we are. And then I've got my knees bent and my arms bent, so this is my first bit I do for a bit of decompression. Now if this goes well, what I'm going to do is straighten up my legs, straighten up my arms, and next thing is important, Breathe into this stretch. You really take deep breaths in and out. And you're really doing your breathing out, relaxing in the stretch. Drop your head. And really hold this for about 10, 20, 30 seconds. And you can repeat this throughout the day. Again, a lovely decompression, passive decompression stretch for your lumbar spine. So another brilliant spinal decompression technique is hanging. So if you have a beam at home uh, and you can, where you can hang from, absolutely brilliant. Problem is, not many people do, so let me demonstrate this to you using a towel. So all you need to do now is have a towel and place this towel around the top of a door. Be a little bit close to where the hinges are so you don't uh, take the whole door out. Uh, so a towel over the top of the door, hold on to both sides. And all you do now is again a partial hang whereby you are uh, transferring the weight from your legs to your arms. Yeah, and hold this for about 30 seconds to a minute. Repeat five times and you can do this all day long. Again, another brilliant technique to take the pressure of your disc and your nerves uh, and your joints of your lower back and create a little bit of pain relief. I hope you liked this video just as much as I enjoyed creating it and I hope it helps you to release that pressure of your lower back. If you did find some relief, please don't hesitate and just give me a thumbs up or leave a comment and subscribe to my channel. For now, I'd say take care of yourself, take care of someone else as well please if you can and bye for now. Bye bye.